Okay. Hi, I'm June Judd. I'm from, I'm a sophomore at Millard South. And this is my poem about cake. Cake. Sometimes I like cake, but sometimes I love cake. So, I was in my apartment. I took a fork from my kitchen, too eager to even comprehend anything. Nothing else mattered. I only cared about that cake. Cake. I love you, cake. Your taste, as sweet as life itself. Your texture, spongy and warm. How I wish to sink my teeth into your moist, sugary innards. My prayer was soon answered by a fair-sized German chocolate cake that stood parallel to my fork. God, how I've dreamt of this, reimagining myself, consuming this diabetes bomb, I found myself drooling on my counter. Enough dilly-dallying. It was time. I took my fork in hand, violently shaking for fear of messing up this magical moment. I had strategically placed my fork at the bottom right of the cake. This would ensure that I would get more frosting and therefore more flavor packed into every bite. I was practically killing myself with anticipation. I had sliced the cake with the side of my fork and had loaded it onto a plate. God, it would take forever to grab it with my fork and eat it. No, I could shave valuable seconds off my time and eat it by hand. I reached for the heart disease cube when suddenly I froze. What if I wouldn't enjoy this cake as much as I thought I would? I thought about the possibility of it being, dare I say, average. <laughs> Doubt comes in. Who am I to think that I would enjoy this cake based on nothing more than its look, its scent? I thought about it for a minute. Screw it, I said to myself. My de my, me, to me, myself, and my dead dog on the floor, I grabbed that cake with the force of Thor's hammer. Nothing else mattered to me now. This was my whole life. This was life or death. The delicious dessert made its way up to my face hole with such speed the Flash himself could not compare. As the cake entered my mouth and landed upon my tongue, I was instantly bombarded with the most orgasmic sensation imaginable. The spongy cake and creamy frosting went so well together, it should be illegal. And this sensation only got better. For as I took another bite, a whole other wave of sensation flooded all over my body. God, this was heaven. It's like hot cocoa after a blizzard. It's like ice cold lemonade on a hot day. It's like when your pillows are cold at night, by God. All the stars began to align as everything became right with the world. No more crime, no more violence, no more world hunger, no more people who blast their music out in public with no headphones. <laughs> Human society has truly evolved into the perfect civilization. My dead dog was resurrected and infused with the strength of 10 whole men. As the fourth and final flavor wave came over me, I began to ascend into my astral form, for I have peaked in my physical body and will no longer require life. As I leave this mortal realm, I wish you all a happy life and a lifetime of prosperity. Whenever you are in need, you may look to the sky and remember that this all started with one delicious piece of cake.